Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be sharing the ultimate spring dress guide. I shared one of these last year and you guys absolutely loved it and found it super helpful. So I wanted to recreate another one this year with all my favorite top picks. Kind of tried to narrow everything down. There are so many favorite dresses this year, so it was kind of even hard to narrow it down to this many. But dresses are just one of my favorite pieces of clothing to wear for spring and even going into summer, a lot of these would be perfect. So I love dresses because they are just a one piece and done. You know, you just throw it on, but it looks so pretty and put together. It's so feminine and it's so comfortable. And you don't really have to think a lot about your outfit with two pieces. So I thought I'd share a mix of casual to dressy casual all the way to some dress see options for like special occasions wedding guest like baby shower bridal shower any spring get together or event um i have a whole mix from every day to a special occasion in this video so i'll have every dress linked out below including all the outfit details i'll try to get everything together for you guys in that description box so you that way you could easily find everything and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy this and want me to share some more dress guides for other seasons so Let's get right into the dress guide. Starting off with this gorgeous midi dress. It's in this gorgeous medium pink, but it does come in quite a few other colors, including white, which is another really great um, neutral dress option. This could be casual or dressy casual, and I love the smocked and sweetheart neckline here, and it has an elastic, stretchy, fluttery shoulder detail and then it just has this flowy bottom portion you can see a look at the back i will be including i believe i'm just going to end up putting in the description box but i'll include undergarments for each style dress whether you need a strapless bra sticky covers or you could wear a regular strap bra all that information will be in the description box and that way i will link to my favorite undergarments as well for a lot of these dresses because i think that's super helpful to know uh, when purchasing any of the dresses or if you're looking into any of them so this one i would do a strapless bra with or you could even just do sticky covers if you wanted to um but yes this is such a great option it does fit true to size and it does come in petite and long lengths as well so i'm in the regular length and i'm five seven i would say up to like five eight i would do the regular length like i think it's between five four and five eight on their website they say to get the regular length um, but I will have all those details listed below. And then the way I styled it for this first look is with these straw sandals. And these are a Walmart find. These, these were like $34. They're so cute and comfortable. I kind of like elevated it a little bit with the straw bag as well. But I'm going to show you guys one other way to style the same dress. Just in a more casual, relaxed vibe. Just kind of like for every day. But this would be right here like such a great vacation outfit or a special occasion even for like a baby shower bridal shower like garden party vibes or even for sunday best okay same dress just different vibes with the more casual relaxed look i just threw on my walmart denim jacket with this this one has like a raw hemline and it's just a nice updated version of a denim jacket and it's really stretchy and comfy and then i also have it styled i just threw on some white tennis shoes and i thought this like totally made it so different and more versatile in my wardrobe so a lot of these dresses i'm about to share especially in the first half are so versatile just based on accessories alone you could either dress them up or dress them down so i did want to add that because i may not like show every outfit two ways so this video will be way too long but um just keep that in mind for a lot of them they're very versatile um, and then i just did like a tote bag so what do you guys think do we like this dress style more casually which way do you see yourself wearing it more how darling is this next dress it's, i can imagine wearing for like a spring get together sunday best or brunch or um like out to dinner even would be so pretty to wear this is a swiss dot baby doll dress so it has like it's just very flowy right under the bust and it's just so flattering um, so it does have a an elastic strap detail and this is from a brand I just recently tried out It's called altered state and one of you guys told me to try it And i'm so glad that I did because they have some pretty cute pieces on there I did order quite a few and I actually say that a little bit over half did not work out for me Personally, but this was one that was like in my top favorites. This is really gorgeous So it has like a rosy pink floral detail and then a look kind of hard to show the back it just has a smocked back detail and i'd say it fits pretty true to size and then i have it styled with some wedges just for a dress you're like you could wear flat sandals if you're just like wearing it on vacation or something i think that would look cute too and then i have it styled with a pink bag just to kind of bring out the pink 
but I think it's a gorgeous silhouette and it does fit true to size. All right, up next is this stunning bow shoulder dress. You guys know I love a bow shoulder moment. And this dress just has so many elements that I think are so feminine, that it's dainty, it's classic. Um, I love this material. It kind of feels like a linen-y fabric. I have to check on what the fabric is, but it feels nice and like breathable fabric, especially I can see for like a really hot day. Um, so this dress, I'm actually going to show you guys three different ways to style. This is kind of like an in-between way to style it. It's dressy casual. This is like out to dinner or like get together, um, on vacation, something that you want to look a little bit more elevated, but still casual and comfy. So this has a self tie shoulder detail has a ruffle and it has that like corset kind of seams happening in the bust area. And I do want to add that this dress does come with built in cups, which is really nice. Um, but if you are smaller chested like me, um, I have a strapless bra on as well underneath just to fill it out. Cause underneath in the chest area, it still had some room. So I use my strapless bra to kind of fill it in a little bit more and it works fine. But if you have a fuller chest, so then the um, cups inside would be perfect. And then um, it just has like a flowy bottom portion. And then the back is smocked. And I just, like I said, have the strapless on, but you totally don't even need one if you don't want to because it has the built-in cup. So I didn't want to add that. Um, for shoes, I accessorize with my flat forms. These are so fun and sparkly. And then also my straw tote, which has been in the best sellers. You guys have been loving this tote bag. So some of you were asking like, what do you put inside since you kind of see a little bit into it? I just use like my Sony Clover pouches. You could use any pouches. I have my Amazon pouches. Um, literally any kind of pouch inside would work totally fine. I've even put my bag organizer in here and it works good too. So I think this is a great dress. This is from Alter State again, that one you guys recommended. And I think it's so cute and true to size. Okay, just to give you guys a visual of how to style it, really casual. Again, I took this dress, I kind of covered up the bow shoulders a little bit with and threw on my white denim jacket just to make it a little bit more dressed down. Not that you can't have the bow shoulder showing even if you want to wear it more casual with the sneakers, but I just wanted to do a layered look because sometimes it's a little bit cooler in the morning or the evening too in the spring. So I think this is really nice to have on and you could take it off during the day. And then also have it on, like I said, white tennis shoes. And then I have my woven tote bag. So it's so casual. And so if you could wear this dress to literally if you have a baby shower to attend then wear it on you know the next day with a denim jacket over it and it looks totally different and you could get away with so much more use out of it so that's just a little inspo for you guys in case you're looking for some ways to get more wear out of your pieces try it with some different accessories and it totally changes up the look and then just to share with you guys the third way of how i would style this dress is dressy uh, so this would be great for if you have like a dinner date or a special celebration. I think this is so cute to wear with some heels too. So just to show how it could look even dressier if you wanted it to. So I would just throw on some cute fun heels and then also even like a statement earring or some hoop earrings and just zhuzh it up a little bit more with your jewelry. I think that would be gorgeous as well. Up next, you guys always request some more like midis and maxis. So on me, this is kind of like in between a midi and maxi. I actually think sometimes Abercrombie calls our dresses midaxis. <laughs> Uh, so it's a good in between and especially depending off you get like the petite regular or uh, tall length It may be a little bit different on you um, But this is the regular length on me and I'm 5'7 you can see it's even like a longer midi So um, but not quite a full on maxi. So this is a gauzy material I don't find this to be see-through because I always get questions whenever I wear something white if it's see-through so this one I would say it's not but obviously I think you would see through it if you wore like you know, bright colored undergarments. So I would do skin tone undergarments with this. And then I think you'd be good to go. Um, this has like a roughly strap. I would still do a strapless bra with this as I'm not sure that a regular strap bra, it might peek through in the back unless that doesn't bother you, then you could totally wear that. I just have on a strapless bra for most of these anyways. So I just have it on, but um, this is like really stretchy here, very comfortable. It does have pockets right here on each side. 
and um, yeah, it's very pretty, very flowy. I did want to add that the lining only goes to here and then it's sheer at the bottom. This is also a good throw in and go like cover up too. I think it would double as a cover up. Throw it on over your swim outfit and go to lunch or something after the pool or the beach. And I think it's stunning. This kind of is very reminiscent, this shoulder detail of Yola Johnson, like tops and dresses, which are hundreds and hundreds of dollars, but this is a fraction of the price. So um, I think it's so classic and pretty. And again, throw it on with a denim jacket if you want to layer it and then make it more casual. Even again, sneakers if you want to. I did these um, thong sandals, which I don't have too many thong sandals in my wardrobe, but these are one of the few that are actually so comfortable. I love them, they're Jack Rogers. And they are so pretty too. And these are great, especially if you have a vacation coming up. These are like a must. I think they're gorgeous. And I did just get a code for them. So I will include it below. Okay, I guess I'm in a vacay state of mind right now because this is the vibe that I put together for this next dress. Um, so this is a way I would style if I was on vacation or something. Um, this is so pretty. This would also look gorgeous for like a baby shower, a bridal shower, or like a backyard picnic or something. This is a good like casual dress but could be dressy too um it's smocked it has the self-tie bow shoulder detail which you guys know i love and then um it just has a flowy bottom portion the lining goes up to here like i'd say a little bit like two inches above my knee so you are like it has a like, good lining so you're covered and you don't have to worry about being sheer or see-through in the sunlight and um it does fit true to size this is a good amazon find i did recently share in a haul video i wanted to narrow it down to like my absolute, absolute favorite. So this didn't get too long. So I, if you want to see some more Amazon dresses, I recently did a haul of them in a video. I think it's called spring. What's new in my spring wardrobe. So I will link that video at the end, but um, that one has so many other good Amazon dresses if you're interested, but this is like one of my top favorites. And then I have it styled with these platforms, which have this pearl buckle detail. And then also just my Tory Burch um, bag right here. And then I did a straw hat, but that I would probably wear just like if I'm on vacation <laughs> or I guess like you're going to like the farmer's market or running errands that you're going to be like outside. Um, this would be cute though. And yeah, I think this is a gorgeous dress. And of course, since it's Amazon, it comes in like a million other colors. So there's a lot to choose from. Okay, literally obsessed with this dress. This is from our Karen Rose spring launch and this was in the top sellers of launch you guys loved it too which i'm really happy so i definitely wanted to include one of my top favorites from karen rose in this um dress guide i think we have a few more left and we are going to be doing another launch very soon so stay tuned i'll be announcing all the details on the shop karen rose instagram page but anyways and um, we are doing free shipping through easter which is really exciting. So free shipping on any order, no order minimum or anything. Um, even though we usually do free shipping over 150, but um, yeah, we're gonna do a little special for Easter and everything will be free shipping. So um, for like to US orders and um, I'll have all the details below, but this dress is included. And this literally looks like something that you would see at like Love Shack Fancy. I could totally see this in their store, but um, this is a fraction of the price and um, it has so many pretty and feminine details like the crochet lace and it does have even a snap closure right here and this can be styled so many ways. Now I'm 5'7", so it's more of like a shorter length on me, uh, but again, if you're like more petite height, it'll be even just like right above your knee, just depending on your height, but I think it's such a great length and it's so gorgeous. I have it on with the bow sandals. These bow sandals were also a top seller from the launch and you guys have been messaging me saying how comfortable they are for you, which I'm so happy you guys love them. And yeah, they're so comfy and so pretty and then i styled it with this straw tote you guys have been seeing me style with a lot of the dresses and then i don't think i mentioned my necklace um this is my pearl initial necklace and i think it looks pretty with a lot of spring outfits and then i just have on my usual jewelry which i forgot to show you guys but i think they are just really classic and i also just have my gold hoops on up next you may recognize this dress from my recent abercrombie try and haul which there's so many good finds there, just like casual outfit ideas. And this was one of the top sellers from the Abercrombie try and haul. It's this, again, midi dress. This is a little bit of a true midi on me for all the other Abercrombie dresses. And this also has the lining up to here. And then it just has this like crochet lace happening throughout. It's very flowy. It does have this button detail. I will say it's just like, for me, I have like 
I don't know, I have smaller chest, so it's like gapping a tad. So I kind of like wish it didn't gap like that. But otherwise, I'd say true to size. And then it has the cinch waist. And then I look at the back and it's completely covered. And then I styled it casually with my tote bag, which has been restocked. And then also my slides. These are designer look for less for the Dior. And I love this neutral. And then just to dress it up a little bit more, I added these gold heels. These remind me so much of Palm Beach. Like they literally just scream Palm Beach vibes. And you guys know that's like one of my favorite places. So I definitely had to get them because they are so pretty and very reminiscent of one of my favorite places. It just gives that Palm Beach very summery vibe with the gold and then like a creamy kind of natural background to them. And they do fit very true to size and so comfortable. So they're a great way to dress up a lot of your dresses. And even with jeans, it would look super cute. And then also my bag. So I just wanna share another way I would dress this um, dress up. Up next is one of my most favorite dresses from Amazon, like pretty much they've ever that I've ever purchased from Amazon. And it is this eyelet pearl button detail dress. So I originally got this dress in blush pink a couple years ago. I'd say like two or three years ago and I love that dress. Um, every time I wear it um, out, people always ask me where it's from or they compliment me on it because it is such a stunning um, silhouette. So it's very flowy when you're walking in. It does have like this little slit in the front but it's really not visible at all, um, but it is there. So you have like mobility, like when you're walking, if you ever have like a maxi dress on or midi and it feels like constricting, well, this also just makes it light and flowy for really hot days. And then it has this like open section here. So I do want to add that there is no fabric under these like two strips of whatever this material is here, but um, the rest is fully lined and the back has like the smocking. So this does, like I said, does come in a couple other colors and I also have the blush pink. I believe they're under the same like brand name on Amazon. I'll have to double check that my original order, but this is, um, I will link to this exact white one and it's so gorgeous. I have it styled with my Walmart slides. These have this adorable um, 3D floral um, on here and I wore these like pretty much all day the other weekend and these were so comfortable you guys i wore them all day like i said and it wasn't even like the best weather conditions and they held up great so i really enjoyed wearing them they, i was so excited to wear them because they're so pretty and they were like 30 dollars or something and so comfortable and then i have on like just a rosy pink bag and i thought this was like such a stunning outfit you could certainly even do like a block heel with this like a nude block heel if you want to dress it up more for a special occasion but yeah i love this outfit so much it's definitely in my top picks next we have this really darling smocked like shorter dress but it's not like a mini length by any means and this is a gorgeous deep navy and i love this like not exactly sweetheart neckline but i like how it kind of dips down a little bit it has this little cinch detail and has a little bow here and then a little like puff sleeve and it's a really flattering silhouette you could see the back there and um, it's such a good staple dress. And this is also Altered State, which you guys let me know about that brand. So I was really excited to find this one as well. I'm gonna have it on with these designer look for less bow slides right here. Up next, we have some special occasion dresses. These are great wedding guest dresses or any formal occasion. Um, so this first one is absolutely stunning. It's a navy dress with this ruffle detailing and wait do you guys see the back which i'll share in a second i love this crisscross detailing happening right under the bust area and then it's very flowy throughout the rest of this dress it does have this like kind of sheer layer underneath but it has an opaque lining and it is just so flattering and gorgeous i have it on with just some nude heels just to add some height okay and then look at that back detail it has this like crisscross and then you just like lace it up, but it's so pretty. Like, in per I feel like the camera's not even doing it justice. It just looks so stunning and flattering. Okay, this next dress may just be one of my top 
favorite wedding guest dresses. It's up in the top, I'd say like five that I've ever shared. This is such a stunning silhouette. Um, I do have sticky covers on with this. I will link my favorite ones as they like stay and they don't like fall off. I've never had like an issue with them like falling off or having like, any issues with them. So um, I will include that below, but I really don't think this is like super plunging. I thought it was gonna be more plunging than what it ended up being. So that's really nice. It has like the flutter sleeve and it has this little like tie detail here. And then it's super flowy. It has this front slit. So it gives you some extra movement with the dress. And then here is a look at the back. It's open back and it has this like t another tie detail at the bottom. So yeah, this would be great wedding dress dress, especially like a garden wedding. This would be beautiful or even like i would totally wear this to, like a fancy dinner like on vacation or something i think this would be so stunning to wear or if you have like photos to take or if you're going to a bridal shower this is really really stunning so for a lot of different occasions for spring and summer and i love the color palette in this dress up next is this really cute tiered ruffle dress it has this little side slit and it even has this tie shoulder detail now this one is a complete sewn strap and then they ended up adding the bows on top so you kind of have a regular strap so you don't have to if this on you know unravels or anything the straps aren't going to come loose which is a nice addition and it has the button detail just for show and it has beautiful like seams and it's very well made i am really happy with the quality of this this is another altered state find this was like under a hundred dollars and then i just styled it with my gold bow heels here's a look at the back it's adjustable straps as well and you can kind of see, I think you can get away with a strapless bra with this. Um, it, I did have a little extra room in the chest. I found that it ran a little roomy. Um, so if you're smaller chested and not sure and in between then size down, um, but I think it's a gorgeous, it's kind of like a watercolor floral. It's really pretty. Next is this really beautiful midi dress. It has this side slit detail on my left side right here. And it's so gorgeous with this like textured floral detail. And it has like a um, corset kind of look at the top. And it does have like the kind of looks like a wired detail here, but it's actually not wired. So it's really comfortable. It does have the tie shoulder it's just like a spaghetti strap and i'd say it fits true to size it's such a comfortable but really um classy like kind of cocktail dress or this is great for a lot of events and occasions even wedding guests and then these bow shoes i thought looked really fun the metallic um with this dress and yeah i just love this color it's kind of a mix between like blush and lavender together it's just a pretty like kind of blush mauve color. Next is this really stunning floral dress, another floral dress. Um, I just have a thing for floral dresses and this is just so flowy and it's fully lined, very well made and comfortable. It has this smocked section right here. It's kind of giving like a boho kind of relaxed vibe, but yet still very dressy and pretty. Um, you could also though like certainly dress it down a bit with flat sandals and have it as like a vacation dress, but this is a very versatile piece. You could even wear it to a wedding if it's a little bit more of like a garden wedding for like the ceremony. I think this would be really pretty to wear. Um, this is true to size and quick look at the back. And I just overall love how this dress, like it's so flowy and just the perfect spring dress. This dress may just be up there in like my top three favorite dresses that we've launched at Karen Rose. So I wanted to share, of course I had to include then this one in my spring dress guide. So this is a rosy pink gingham dress. This is in our another top seller in our launch, in our recent launch. And like I said, there are a lot more fun launches to come. So stay tuned on our Instagram for when we are doing our next launch. This has like this stunning ruffle shoulder detail and then you could see a look at the back it has like the tie right there and it's just such a flowy dress and it's not like too short um i'm 5'7 and it's a good length and i think this is just so fun like tie your hair back or in a ponytail or in a little like messy bun and i think it just like makes the shoulders stand out and it's really gorgeous and then i just did some white or, like creamy white accessories to finish off the look. And then in case you're skipping around, I do wanna mention that we are doing free shipping on Karen Rose through Easter. Um, I'll have all the details, though. I can't remember the exact date the 
free shipping ends, but I'll include it below. Um, but this is included so you can get this shipped for free and um, so many other like cute things on the site too. All right, up next is this gorgeous midi dress in this really cute floral print. It kind of has a yellow and soft orange tones to it with green and then a white background. It has the cinch detail with a little ruffle and then these straps, um, you can see are adjustable and I would say this fits true to size and it's just such a good flowy dress. I would even style this with a denim jacket on top, either blue or a white one. I think either one would look so nice layered. And then I just have on my bow slides and I think it just like completes the look. It's simple, but really elegant and pretty. So that is it for my spring ultimate dress guide. If you guys found this video helpful, be sure to give it a thumbs up and let me know which dress was your favorite in the comment section below. And I'm gonna see all of you in my next video very soon. Bye. You're making me, you're making me whole.